everyone, we're going to find the antiderivative using variable substitution for the integral of a to the power of 2x dx. Alright, we're going to use this formula here. Alright, um, and I'll write it down. So we have the integral of a to the power of x dx equals a to the power of x. And instead of ln natural log, I'll just put log. Uh, log of a plus c. Now, in our case, we have this 2x. So for a variable substitution, let's let t equal uh, 2x. So derivative of t, um, uh, this would be 2dx. Or our dx is going to equal 1 half dt. So using substitution, we're going to get for our problem the integral of a to the power of t dt, but our um, dx here is one half, so I have to put a one half in front. All right, now let's substitute back in our t and use this formula. So this is going to equal uh, a to the power of t divided by log of uh, a plus c and we still have this one half. So I'm going to put the two in front there. And after that, all we have to do is substitute back in our t, which is 2x. So our final answer is going to be a to the power of 2x divided by 2 log of a plus c. Now since this is a short video, I added another problem. So we can do the same thing. We're going to let t equal uh, 4x plus 3, therefore uh, dt equals 4dx, or we could say dx equals 1 fourth dt. Now using substitution, we're going to write this as 1 fourth times the integral of 5 to the power of t uh, dt. This dx, I just separated it out. Using my formula now, this is going to give me 1 fourth times 5 to the power of t divided by log of t, log of a, so 5 plus c, and then all you have to do is substitute back in your t. So this is going to end up being uh, 5 to the power of 4x plus 3 divided by 4 times log of 5 plus C. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.